Saturday morning, New Year's Eve. Everybody's packing up. We're hitting the road by 7 a.m. It's time for me to go finish up packing up. I just came from up there. Our main goal, our main destination today is Conjunction Bay. That's where we want to spend New Year's Eve. I think we got at least six, seven hours of driving on pavement, so. Should be fun. Punto de verificación y inspección interna. Point of verification of internal inspection. I'm guessing this is for agricultural stuff. There's something on the ground that sprays up the undercarriage, the underside of your vehicle. And you have to actually pay some pesos too to go through. Hola. Hola, buenos días. Okay. 20 pesos. Muchas gracias. Adiós. It's right there. Interesting. We have just arrived here and we're gonna stop at a coffee shop, get a little bit of coffee, get a little food. Santa Rosalina is such a cool little town, but with the trailer and just being how narrow everything is, we're having a tough time finding somewhere to park. We'll find somewhere, but it might take a little bit. Coffee and some lunch, hopefully. Let's <laughs> right. get out of here, get out of here, let's go. Michael's ready, Jesse's, Jason's. We made it. Hey, what's going on? You got five parking? Yeah, it's parking, good. Yeah, yeah. good. It is getting hotter the further south we go. Yeah, I mean, Just Corey, would you like some? This is going to be good. Yeah, I'm going to put order one to go. There's so much carbonation. Yeah. Uh, Mason's gonna have one now too. Senor, thank you. Gracias. Salud, salud. Gastrovia. None of us have alcohol. Actually, no. Jesse has a tequila. It actually is really good mineral. There's so much carbonation. It just makes it all worth it. Our food just came. Tacos. I couldn't even get out the camera in time before I ate almost all of them, so they're really good. And they got some good music going. That guy though, I don't know. Flash around a little. See that? See what's going on? That type of stuff. 
Look at that. That's what I'm talking about. That is the stuff that I'm talking about. How cool is that? We have made it to camp. This is where we are spending New Year's. Oh, it's cool. It's great. We're going to go for a little night swim, little New Year's Eve dip in the water. Yeah! Go, 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 go! Go, 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 all the way in! Go, her in! Go, her in! Go, her in! Well, guys. Is that it? I think it's, I think it's oh, midnight. Yeah. Wow! Woo! Happy New Year! Happy New Year! Happy New Today's gonna be more of a bounce kind of a day. I'm still a little sore from the other day. Stay close. Good morning. Oh, no, no. Good morning, Mason. Yeah, good morning, Jay. Good morning. <laughs> First day of 2018. Woo hoo! Woo! Right on. <laughs> this looks pretty good. We all, we all just passed out pretty much. And this is. It's a new year. It's a new year. 2018. It feels weird. It's so weird. It feels it's a new weird. Year. Absolutely beautiful campsite out here. And there's actually this really cool spot. We were going to check it out last night, but there wasn't enough room for all of us. You can camp there during low tide, you can cross. Then during high tide, it's inaccessible. So you got to wait for the tide, but it's like this really cool remote little camping site. Every six hours, that's what happens. How cool is that? But we didn't stay there because we have too many, too many vehicles. We stayed here instead, but it works out really, really great. And we're right by the water. Beautiful. Right there. This is, I think this is red, called Red Tide. It's with the plankton. This is how it looks in the day. That's what the stuff that was glowing last night. It was, yeah. Last night, that bioluminescent effect on the water, that was the plankton right there. And you can kind of see it wash up on shore. So you can imagine as it gets really thick, Everywhere you walk, it just psh, psh, psh. The water is absolutely amazing. It's so nice. Can you just eat it? Yeah, they. Come here, see? <laughs> oh. Yeah, they just found it. It's crustacean. Mm-hmm. Couple them the most one. And they just put a little lime on there, a little yeah, chipotle, really cool. and they're just gonna eat it straight up. Uh huh. También quien contó este caracol. Hey. Wow. ¿Lo han comido ustedes en Mexas? Um, poquito. Do you wanna try? Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no he probado. You don't want to? Pero él quiere probar a ver. Sí. Oh, I'm gonna, oh, I'm just gonna eat it. Just gonna do it. See? The drone disconnected and dropped out of the sky. It was higher than the vehicles. It should have never... Did that bother it? No? Should be all right? Well, I had one stuck up in a tree for 10 days in Salt Lake City during the winter. It snowed and rained and it worked. <laughs> that Matt was cute ran in and grabbed today. it. Thank you so much, man. <laughs> Thank you, man. We didn't even know it was in the water. We just thought it disconnected yeah, flying. I we just thought it was hovering. Yeah. <laughs> It literally, I'm flying it, disconnect, and then, <laughs> oh my god.
time for rice. This is what we ended up doing with the G Roan. Got it in here, battery. We're gonna let it soak in rice. Should be good. We'll see. I have faith, right? I got lots of faith. I have faith too. I think it'll work. We have such a great group with us, don't we, Izzy? Yeah. These people are wonderful. We're having a great time, and it is time for dinner. And it's gonna be wonderful. Because Jesse's dinner, cooking. Jesse's a great dinner cook. dinner of the year. Yes. Let's go. Bring the tortillas. Yes. Everything's over there. Tortillas. Bring your plates. Okay. okay. And let's go. We had so much good food on this trip. And instead of calling it Mexican food now, I just call it food because it's just become part of my normal diet. I'm gonna end this video with two things. First off, I have new Patreon pledges to thank. And second off, I recently hit 100,000 subscribers. I cannot thank you guys enough. Building up the channel, living this lifestyle, all of it has been such an interesting wild ride. And I just wanna share my experiences with you guys. So I will be making a separate video on that. And it's mostly just a thank you because that's why all of this is possible. I have so many wonderful people to thank. That being said, I got some new Patreon pledges to thank as well. Nick Morris, Maddie Bicey, Ian Merkel, and Jeremiah Bullfrog Case. Maddie, Ian, Nick, Jeremiah, thank you guys so much for helping us out, supporting this journey, keeping this possible. All right, everybody, we'll see you guys soon. Roll the bloopers. The food is done. Oh, Check this out. Ceviche? Ceviche. <laughs> Savi, uh, Say. whatever. <laughs> the other day, Matt caught a flounder. It was delicious, sir. Ceviche. 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 The other day, Matt caught a flounder. It's such great ceviche. <laughs> Apparently, it's like the hardest word. I cannot say this. Ceviche. Ceviche. No, no R. Se. Se. Ceviche. Ceviche. Matt. Just think of the first word and you'll good. You'll be good. Ceviche. Yeah. Ceviche. 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 No cerveza. You're thinking of cerveza. 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 Ceviche. 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 Just think of the V. Cevi. Ceviche. There you go. Ceviche. Cevi. And it's not spelled with an S, it's spelled with a C. Ceviche. Okay. The other, the other day, Matt caught a huge flounder. We had some great ceviche. It was amazing. Can I say it right? No! Ceviche. Perfect. Is that right? Yes. yes. Ceviche. That's what we're hoping to have some more of tonight. Because yeah. the other day, Matt caught a flounder. He's good luck. We're hoping he catches some more. There you go. <laughs> Italian accent when you're thinking about ceviche. Ceviche. Very good. Yes. Ceviche.